welcome or welcome back to my channel today as i promised i have a special special wax melt basket to share with you and the reason why it's special is because these are the items i've chosen to take home with me with to share with my family they have one wax melt warmer they don't want too many but they like the one and it's in the living room so i definitely have some scents here that i think will just be powerhouses and sent up the entire space. To get started, I'm gonna share with you guys what's on my nails. It is from ILNP, and it is hard to show you what this nail polish really looks like. Of course, it looks blue and purpley, but there is like a hue of green. It is like a multi-chrome-ish, not chrome, but multi-dimensional color. You can sort of, sort of kind of see it when I twist there. It's got that green hue to it, but this is from ILNP. And this is in the color, oops, sorry about the light. It is in color Tilted. So I really, really love this color. So as I mentioned, this is gonna be a very, very quick video, but it's special to me because I haven't been home for a proper Christmas. I can't recall if it's eight, between eight and 10 years. So all those traditions that we all have, or maybe most of us do, I can't wait to share them with Nelson and share it with our traditions with him. Um, a lot of it has to do with food and drink, so, you know. We're gonna be about 400 pounds when we get back, but that's okay, because I'm gonna have to work my butt off when I get back. But with that being said, I love bringing different scents that I think my family will really enjoy. There is one family friend of ours who may come to visit who is very scent sensitive, so we may have to turn it off, or if it bothers her, we may just have to turn off it, um, that kind of thing when she's there. But with that said, let's just get started here. Right off the bat, one of my absolute favorite scents at this time of year, it brightens the mood because of that, gl that glowing ginger ale. This is Red Nose from Rainbow Melts. This is Tart Cranberries and Glowing Ginger Ale. Two really good pieces. One of these pieces each time we melt will be perfect. I think it'll be just a beautiful, bright, change of pace from some of the heavier scents that I've got coming or very sweet scents coming. Then I decided to pull this one here. This is gifted to me by my friend Ramona, Ramona Talk here on YouTube. This is an Icicles and Evergreen and I believe it to be the scent of the month for the month of November, I think, but she gifted this to me the last time I was here and it smells beautiful. It smells like icicle, like a definitely outdoorsy, crisp air, and then the evergreen scent. So I thought because my parents also have a faux tree that this might bring a little life into the room in the sense that maybe it'll make it smell like it's a real tree kind of thing. So ambiance, if you will, through scent. So I wanted to pull this one and bring it with me. On the tree theme, but also cranberry. Because you know this girl needs cranberry. This is a fir balsam, spiced cranberries, apples, oranges, and grapefruit. So bright, zesty, woodsy, not woodsy, um, needly. <laughs> balsam needles and cranberry which is very tart which I thought would be perfect and you guys again you know me and freaking cranberry I have a lot of it stay tuned there's more and cranberry who was surprised anyone anyone surprised here no no okay this is iced winter cranberry again I rave about this if you're in the U.S. and you see this left on your shelf grab them I was very very um spoiled if you will by friends of mine who sent me these uh, I did get this one I had it in my possession in February of this year but I know I, they were being held for me and since the fall of 2020 I believe anyway I am really looking forward to this this has been a repurchase of mine I absolutely love this and you know what better homes and gardens I do use two wax cubes from Better Homes and Gardens, but it that is pretty strong. It's really strong. And from Zape, we have Flat White. I'm like, well, mornings, I might actually do two cents each day for a round. Coffee scents in the morning, and of course, the other ones that we're mentioning, maybe later on in the evening. Um, this is Flat White. It's one of my favorite scents. You guys know that. This is perfectly perfect. This is espresso and vanilla cream, and I really enjoy this one. I know my mom's going to love the coffee scent too. Continuing with Zape, I'm bringing Elf Cookies. This one is described as sugar cookie dough, almond macaroons, and vanilla buttercream frosting. And this is nice, sweet, but not too ooey gooey, but I think it'll be a nice treat for maybe the evening after dinner, like a dessert kind of scent. This would be beautiful. And plus we can cut this up into many different uh, sizes and get a few uses out of this. Another coffee scent. So I've got Christmas morning from Super Tarts. 
This is freshly brewed coffee, whipped cream, and candy canes. So this is a beautiful one. I've had it for a while. I've had it for almost two years now. So it's time for me to melt this one. And I do enjoy the scent. A staple tradition in my family, <laughs> at least for me anyway. Yippee ki yay, and we know the rest of that sentence. This is one of my favorites to melt on Christmas. This is described as iced sugar cookies and pine needles. So perfectly blended of outdoorsy, indoor baking, all of that stuff. This is so good, you guys. And of course the movie, you know, Christmas. Um, I love this scent as well. So definitely a staple for me. And this has been a repurchase many times. And it couldn't be a video with me going home and taking Hedwig with me. This is my one of my top favorite chai tea scents or blends from any vendor. This is chai tea, creamy cheesecake, and clove. It's the spices that I really like. I really could care less about the cheesecake or the, you know, whatever. It's the chai tea, the black tea, the spices, like the nutmeg, the cinnamon, the clove, all of that stuff that goes into this um, is beautiful. So I had to bring it home with me, right? Yeah. Right. And last but not least, I have from Goose Creek. This is snow to covered apple. I thought this would be a nice change. Again, more of an apple scent. I have a lot of cranberry. I have a lot of sweet, some coffee. So I thought, you know, we'll, we'll put this one in here. And I've never melted this one before. So I am looking forward to trying it. So there are like, it's like the game uh, Trivial Pursuit. And there are six little triangles here and we can break off a couple each time we want to use it. So you guys, that is my special melting basket for pretty much the second half of December and the first day in January. We're gonna be away for a couple weeks, um, but again, we'll be in and out of the house a lot. I think we're going snowshoeing and all these fun things and just a lot of fun activities with the family I haven't seen in quite some time. So while we're home, we'll be melting these. So with that being said, as always, be safe, take care, and have fun. Bye, guys.